Testing, does this work? I just wanted to make sure. Hello guys. Don't mind the civilians over there. They're uh, for a very special test. So, I was just alerted of a mod through a VCM, and right? I was just alerted of a mod of one of my favorite entities from a particular game. A game that's unfortunately no longer available due to the company who made it going bankrupt and unfortunately falling off the face of the earth. Now, this entity... Who are you again? Are you again? No, oh, don't worry. You'll, you'll meet... You'll meet God soon. This entity is from a very particular Minecraft game. In particular, Minecraft Story Mode. Now you'd be wondering, what's the most iconic thing from Minecraft Story Mode? Ivor, the command block, mm, the the Who nice adventure again? that they're going on. No, that's the weather storm. One of my favorite monsters in history, what do I do because to just this? the sheer, sheer terror caused by this entity. It's I just sorry. knew it was you know it's a threat. Okay, guys, you're gonna die soon. You know that, right? All right, but without further ado, say hello to the Witherstorm. Now, the Witherstorm, one of my favorite entities because in the game, which I've never actually played the game to its full. Yeah. Excuse me. We're gonna have to go, guys. Freeze that moment. <coughs> I'm gonna remove it. Is, is it NPC as well? No, that'd be unfortunate. Oh, I'm sorry. I just. I love the Wither Storm so much. Because it has the threat value, it rips apart your world. One of my favorite mods in Minecraft is literally Cracker's Witherstorm mod. Because it adds such a beast of a creature. You know this thing holds a threat when you know when you figure out. When you find this thing, when this thing is in your world, when this thing is kind of trying to. Unfortunately he seems to be stupid sometimes, but not well. volume of this man. You know he holds a threat when everything in your world gets destroyed. The only safe place in the world is the end and the nether. Okay, I don't know what's causing the lag. Oh, 
probably due to how many civilians I have for me, though. So, I could already think of a few ideas for this. Obviously, the developer has his own stuff. Their own stuff. Um, maybe a kind of, like, radius in which it follows the player. I don't know if it actually follows me. Actually, I haven't really tested it. I haven't actually ran from it. Well, either way, there's not really much running from it, really. Okay, so line of sight needs required for him to actually... One is maybe a kind of way of preventing him from getting stuck on things for areas like this. Having him levitate maybe higher up in case he's getting stuck on something. Oh, I love this. The Witherstorm is, is just one of those things I love so fucking much. options on this floor. Outside of removing the music, which I'm never going to remove. I'm not getting money from this, so God be holy, please don't murder me. Your music is absolutely fucking negative. Yeah, unfortunately you get stuck on things. It's wide open areas that you... The light itself is full. You're following me. Towards this man, because obviously, why the fuck are I running over here? An idea. Don't mind this object. It's not. I use Chat GPT to make fucking things spawn on the map, and a few other things to make some of the board. You. Come with me as well. Does he pick up props? I don't understand if he would if he would lag when he does that. Stuff does get sucked up. This is no longer following you. Yeah, because I kind of fucking died. Does he follow the player? But he just seems to like really turn, like his fa his eyes don't really face the turn. Like he turns to face the player, but his eyes don't exactly do that. Maybe like if you're running around or jumping and shit, like maybe if you're like quiet and slow moving, he won't spot you. But like if you're like flashing the camera, hell, if I fucking shoot at him. Here, run, bud. This is horrifying. You see those spotlights roaming about. Bud, sorry, man. What the fuck? Oh, that's probably a mod I have. Oh, but he's dead! He's dead! Ah! Hold on. Can I? Can I? Hold on. No. Oh, no. The 
Duck it there. Oh. Yeah, I think I need a bigger area for this, actually. Bigger area for this. Bigger area that is in Alright, we're starting this anew. This reinvigorated my love for G, my dear God. No, I'm not gonna feed the Witherstrom chips. Man, just get my fucking chips. My only question is, does this thing work on other next bots? Like, it works on NPCs, but I'm just hoping it works on next bots. What you could also do, and this is just to the creator, I doubt he'll see this. I mean, I'll post it there, but I doubt he'll actually watch this. If he does, well then, obviously. I thought for a second I heard the rumbling of him already. That <laughs> would be funny. So, for, so an idea, right? Hey, this is just as a visual thing. So the particles that you use to um create um okay. I don't know why it's so laggy. Oh, this map is not even fucking big. The skybox is so damn small, unfortunately. Hold on. I love the music though. The music itself is actually phenomenal. You know for a fact you're in danger when the music is playing. Boris is a perfect idea. Big enough that it actually it allows the Witherstorm to track. Also, I did realize that the Witherstorm does seem to follow the player, but it doesn't seem to be like obviously with like certain maps it doesn't seem to get around all that much. Obviously, I don't know, given the fact that the models themselves are pretty difficult to find, I do know where some are, though. What if, right? Is there a chance the other, um, the other phases could be created? Obviously, nothing, like, too prestige- like the interior of this man, obviously that makes there's no way to do that effectively. But don't hear me out. Here's an idea that could be like interesting. When the world loads up, it spawns the um Witherstorm body, right, just on the map. You know, like the fucking Soul Sand command block. Fucking what? I don't know why I fucking rotated there. This map I know is big enough because. It's the fucking biggest map in existence. Alright. Okay, why is it lag, though?
Is it because it's trying to target multiple things? don't know what's the lagging issue. Unfortunately. It's when those come out. Well, the drum itself is not an issue, it's when the heads come out. The heads are the issue. I wasn't doing that for the one map. This is confusing. Either way, I fucking love this. I don't care if it's like a bit laggy at times. Cause this, this is amazing. I think that the, the, the um, okay, so, I do like how it pi actually picks up objects. I think what could be interesting is that the head will automatically try to go and pick up objects like that. Not just that, but also when it comes to like, um, like, obviously like have it like maybe like rotate to like try to like pick up objects. But it also block blocks. Oh my god, I have my camera up ahead. At random objects that are props and well, people obviously not, but props themselves. Props should definitely be automatically at sometimes being pulled up to the wither room. Hell. Oh, obviously you've already got the particles. You don't need to actually have them incorporated. Oh, I love this. Is that as he's roaming around, like maybe he can actually spot NPCs. Maybe if his eye goes close to them, maybe if the laser goes close to them, he will actually spot them and move it towards them. I don't know if that's already a fact.
Oh, I just... I'm sorry, this is just... This... Is fucking cool. He will only face me if I'm the only NPC, so he knows where everything is. to make dupes. However, wait, hold on. <coughs> I'll be right back to not only just get rid of my terrible AI shit. Uh, I'm thinking, right, of adding or going and getting Minecraft to Getting the Minecraft swept, because that one exists, I know for that. Go back onto Big City. And just mess around there. Because this is fucking cool. I love this so much. This is actually good. Is actually really, really fucking good. Leggy on big maps, I've noticed, but... Otherwise, it's just good. It's just so fucking good. I can't with this. <laughs> Hold on, I need to reopen. I have nothing but respect for that. Dear God, breaking shit. Okay, everyone. I don't normally get VJ add-ons, right? Because I just, right? I don't usually get Minecraft add-ons. However, I will here. The actual good Minecraft add-ons I know of, not the fucking... Oh my god, of course he made that. I've had I've messed around with these NPCs before, but I never actually like kept them because I'm pretty sure their textures broke. However, in the very end, it won't really matter all too much. First of all, what map? I need a big, decently sized map that the Witherstorm's not going to get stuck on shit. But also small enough that the Witherstorm is not going to be lagging the fucking game, unfortunately. Aha. This one should go. This one should do.
This brought me back to Gmod. Get singular add on. The singular add on brought me back to Gmod. Fun times. I'm sorry. Hold on, messing me up. I can't have, uh, Terrible, terrible shit be within the... G-Force overlay. No. I am out of chips, Sag. Let's say eight. Yep, that's fair. I'm gonna rename that to Minecraft. Are there mo are there textures working? They are, but unfortunately, it will not matter for you guys. Fortunately, I shall end all things. Sorry guys, you were doomed. No, 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 stop, stop this. Let's talk about this brother, let's talk about this brother, let's talk about this.
actually gonna keep this because it seems like it's actually just about fixed. Master this weapon habit compatible. Cow, stay within this box if you value your life! Of course you don't! No, stop with that. Stop! Stay within the box if you value your life! Okay, there we go. But an idea, right? Something related to the particle thing. So you know how there's like those block particles? What if, right, you get like a bunch of like random chunks in the shit, in like shit, and have them spawn within the earth and then move up to him? As if it will. So just simulate what it looks like to have the Wither Storm rip apart your world. Okay, I was about to say, I just thought I lost my whoosh, my, my, um, cow friend. No! No! Stay! Stay within the box! Cool. How's your day? You know what? You're right. You, you don't like life. Build up. <laughs> oh, that's horrifying. Just watching him from afar. Oh, I'm seeing poor things being pulled up and consumed. which means that any NPC he currently kills will be permanent, meaning eventually he's going to turn around and start moving towards me. He has, he has omniscience, so he knows where everything is.
I love this. Just watching him from afar. This is this is spooky shit. No amount of cave dweller, hero brine, fucking Spider-Man, whatever is spooky in Minecraft. This is true horror in Minecraft. <laughs> That poor villager is currently within the storm. Villager, be careful, villager. You are you are riding death right now. You are basically within that and you're dead. And you're dead. That that's unfortunate. That cow is also within dangerous grass. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he. he I fucking saw where that was going. Oh, he turned even immediately. Where is he looking for? in the water! Oh, that's horrifying. Oh, I also just... Yeah, I also... I knew it for a fact killing him was a bad idea.
just I'm sorry, I can't with this. I can't. It's so fucking in there because that chicken. <laughs> He's looking for that chicken and that cow over there. how fast he like switches charges. Yep. He doesn't actually know where I am though, so. And well, I know he doesn't look up. Well, I just... interesting guy I thought that it could be interesting is if by attacking the eye that's currently picking you up does this eye stay on you when you like Fuck back there. I do love this. It feels like the wither storm. Get into the fucking water.
like how he's like. Yeah, I do like that how he will always try to orient himself. He feels a lot. This is literally just the Wither Scroll. For the Minecraft. God bless the individual who made this. Thank you so fucking much. This has been one of the things I wanted in Gmon for a very long time. No. This is one thing I wanted in Gmon so, for so fucking long. Because it is one of those things that's just fucking amazing. But something I did want to try. I'm in ignorable. I did want to try. Dupes. The one thing I don't play with at all are dupes. My dupes, those are not my dupes. Super Fred Man. What are these? Why am I subscribed to this? No. I'm confused. Why am I. Anyways. This is probably gonna completely crash my game. In all honesty. Him trying to take apart this house. Oh, this is gonna be neat though. That is leg. Okay, oh, I completely forgot about something else. He shoots Wither Skulls. That would be also an interesting thing to have, is that he would, like, periodically shoot Wither Skulls at, at random locations that would create, like, blast damage. I don't know. Like that. Hell, maybe there's a fire add-on that adds, like, the fire from Minecraft as well. I don't know, because, like, this has so much fucking potential. This has so much potential. Large. is so fun. This might be the only thing I will ever say about a single thing. Maybe a controllable version, but that's just me. I'm just the I'm just the complete nerd when it comes to the web drum. I also love how he reflects the water. That's obviously just a, a Gmon thing where you reflect. He 
need D10. Eh. Ew. I love it so much. However, if I don't cut it here, I will be playing with this for entirety and this will become a one hour video. So all I gotta say is thank you to the developer. This is already 50 fucking minutes long, dear god, what have I done? Thank you for watching, I'm gonna edit here. No editing, just, I'm gonna edit here. Thank you for watching, bye bye. <laughs>